But he made this double ball. Uh, <laughs> what? What a shot! What? No! Uh... Alright, so welcome guys to another, uh, what do you want to call this, like a team effort <laughs> between the two of us? <laughs> Collab, yeah. Collab, yeah. Um, so I made this, uh, this thing called a custom ball arena. You'll be seeing a lot more of it with different ball shapes. Um, but he made this double ball. Uh, <laughs> what? What a shot! What? No! Uh... I thought I had it. <laughs> What just happened? Pinch. Um, but yeah, he made the, 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 the double ball. Like, he basically took the Rocket League ball uh, mesh and everything and then just doubled it with a hole in the middle. And I made this map to, like, test it out on. But this thing has some weird properties, if you want to explain it, Glenn. Oh. Um, in simple, I, like, simpler terms. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure I can without a diagram. Yeah, basically, the way that Rocket League balls work is that it calculates from the center of the ball, so hitting the middle part makes it bounce backwards that's the easiest way to explain it i guess you'll probably see it at some point oh nice dude oh. it's so weird to like react to it i'm just <laughs> flying at it at the moment dude. yeah like that <laughs> this is so ridiculous I, don't know why it spins like that. I love it it's so good it's like nothing like we've seen before coming in hot oh, oh blocking I think the the weight of it <laughs> the weight of it's actually kind of perfect right now. It, it does behave really strange, but uh, oh. did not expect it to do that though. What a catch! <gasps> oh, what? <gasps> oh my god! So that might be an example where I hit the inside of the ball, <laughs> so the vector goes in the opposite direction to what you expect. Yeah, like you hit. Yeah, see, you hit underneath it, and it actually like it's a cool way to like pinch the ball. That's insane. It can do some crazy stuff. Also, see how the kickoff is. We actually end up facing off on different balls. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. Okay. So yeah, we can get some really weird stuff going on. Yes, yeah, so you can hit it down doing that as well. Yeah, so that's cool. Pitch it it's unique to Rocket League. Towards the ground, but... Can I score this? This would be apps. Absolutely crazy with more than two people as well. I, I'm looking are. forward to like, yeah, being a big party of this thing. Look at its speed. <laughs> it's so we haven't even increased the rotation speed. <laughs> it's because the ball, it's the ball does spin that fast in Rocket League, but because it's so large, it's and larger. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like giddy like a little child. It's so funny. <laughs> Come on, I can't score this. It's too close to the. Oh yeah, yeah. Here it is. I can't see. I can't see. No. Oh, Look at it spin, dude. Look at it spin. No, no, not no. happening. Oh, what a save. Thanks, dude. It's, not spinning. it's actually stopped entirely. Get out of here. Uh. So yeah, the, the goals are a little scuffed, but kind of on purpose to like... I needed to make them big enough that if we make a giant ball, it has to fit inside the goal. Oh, that's... Come on, dribble. That's your chance. Dribble, 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 dribble. No, it's, dude, it, it's catching me. <laughs> no, it actually caught my no. car. You gotta remember, it's heavier. <laughs> Look at it spin. I love it. Oh my. It's actually really hard to score, even though the net's gigantic. <laughs> so, I didn't tell you about this one as well. Well, I don't think I've shown you it. Um, but I've got a Formula One car on this time. Oh, oh yeah, you never, you never said what car you're using this time. Um. Speaking of, I don't even know why this came up. Like when you said you didn't know what you, I was, I thought you were gonna talk about like a different ball shape. Well, this this is most definitely a goal, right? Yeah, nice. This is sick. Formula One, eh? Like yep. with the full spoiler and everything. Yeah, the lot. That's sick. Oh, come on, bounce out for me. Yes, that's just in. I think. <laughs> oh, there's no way I could do that. So Let's see, guys, um, the way that that works there. Um, off this this goal here, you can see that only the middle part of the goal the ball has to go in because the anchor point or like the center of the ball is in the middle, and you can't we can't change. I don't know if we can. Can you change the detection? Like I don't think we've discovered um, that yet. 
I mean, it was only today that we worked out that that's how it works. So uh, I've not really tested, but right. we'll keep trying. I, it works in some some respects. I, I'm not sure if it is possible because if you think think about how uh, the puck works, right. I mean, the puck the is middle. scored. No, the puck is scored perfectly, isn't it? Oh, no, there it is. What? Oh, I thought I got that. Yeah, it oh, almost. That like the. <laughs> I didn't even notice you get stuck inside <laughs> the middle there. Um, no, I, um, I think, you know when you're far away from the ball, there's a little white dot as as the visual indicator. Is it still a ball? I, or a puck? Yeah, I think that's... Let me... Yeah, we should circle. go. Yeah, we should look at that real quick. Oh, come on. Oh! Okay, I was gonna say. I thought I got that. I, thought I know. I got it. Is it really laggy for you? Uh, I mean, the ball is going quite far in the net, or I say it came quite far out the net when I thought I saved it. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. So it will be a little different. I can't believe we, we made two crazy shots at the start, and then this has like been the slowest gameplay. <laughs> oh, okay. <gasps> Look at it go. I know. I love it. It's so cool. Is that going to just spin in? <laughs> Who knows? It's a mind of its own. So we could do this, and we could also have like a, a dumbbell shape with like a bar in the middle, so you can actually hit it in the middle. Yeah, so um, that's what I actually had originally, and I thought, why don't I just remove the bar? Yeah, for sure. Dude, we were- oh my god! Dude, that was Rocket. so cool! So like, you hit the other ball, and I hit the other- like, I hit the other side, and it ended up spinning for you. Watch this. Let's have a look. Oh, it, you kind of hit both. Oh. oh, wow. Yeah. That's cool. This is, this is actually a lot of fun. Let's hit like both sides, like this, the sides. Oh, there it is. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah, like spin it. It has some weird bit. <laughs> yeah, so you just hit the inside of it. I'll do this. Yeah. Oh it. Go my god. You hit the inside. Ah, oh. Like this just opens up the possibilities for what is like what we could do with this. Oh my god, dude. How? <laughs> I like pinched it and like boom the other way. Look at it go! I know! Did you hit the inside? <laughs> yeah, I hit the inside again. I'm trying to hit the inside a bunch of times, see what happens. Oh no. Oh, uh, <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh, this is <laughs> so cool. Do you want to try a smaller one? Or like, or like a bigger one? Yeah. Yeah, yeah let's yeah, try the ball size. Okay. Dangerous. Dude, this is this is playing with fire. We're gonna do we're gonna do a curve ball after this with the smaller. <laughs> Maybe the smaller one. <laughs> I actually tried curveball on the rugby ball, and uh, it didn't seem to do too much, actually. No? No. But I feel like with this one, with the giant center of mass, it might do some crazy stuff. But, I'm not sure if it's its own archetype. I haven't looked. Oh, you're totally can... right, I wonder. The thing is- Oh! <laughs> what? <laughs> so but they... we would be able to copy it. Yeah, that's true. I think it it's just a-, a, a... A property of physics because it's a uh, it works for the cube and the puck too. It works. Does for it? Yeah, yes. it does. Wow, what a doll. Thanks, man. I was scrambling. <laughs> this uh, the smaller one's a little bit weirder. <laughs> it's kind of hard to hit. I'm gonna go on the inside. <laughs> oh, it rotated round me. <laughs> yeah, I did cool. the inside too, so it, was, it acted all weird. Oh my. That's like, like from space. Oh no. <laughs> oh, sure. I thought, thanks. I thought it was going to hit off the, the post. Yeah, it's close. <laughs> Dude, I'm, I'm so giddy right <laughs> now. This is so silly. I just love that we can do this to the game. Oh my There's God. so many possibilities, is that? I know. Oh, God. Wait, where am I going? That was weak. That was so weak. <sighs> yeah, sometimes it booms and sometimes it. Okay, here we go. Go ahead. Dribble on the inside. <laughs> Dribble on the inside. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible. Oh no. Oh, no. I think that's good. Oh. oh. Inside, inside. No. Uh, thanks. Is that going in? Oh, oh what no. a save. It slowed down a lot. Yeah. Alright. Um. I don't know how I got that pinch like the first goal I did. Oh, oh. <laughs> just like that. Oh, man. <laughs> We definitely have to try curveball right after this. It's gonna happen. Yeah. 
If it doesn't work, guys, we'll we'll show that it doesn't work, and then we'll try something something wackier for the final one. Oh, it, it like actually pinched with me over and over again. <laughs> oh. Oh, you spiked the net? No, I wanted to do the, the inside thing and pinch, but it didn't work. Oh, yeah. Give it a go. Are you dribbling? Uh, not intentionally. <laughs> it's kind of working. It was just getting the same speed as me. Whoa! What? Did you, did you do it? I just sat inside the middle of it and just kind of boomed. Sometimes it does it and sometimes it, do it doesn't. Have you found that? It sometimes doesn't. Yeah, that I way. noticed that too. I think, is it when your car blocks it enough? Yeah, it like, it, it keeps b bouncing into you over and over again. Trying to do it, it's not working. <laughs> um, like that? Wow. Oh, oh, oh dang. Failed half of it. Try that again. I'm excited to see what the uh, the Formula One car looks like. Oh, you've not got sticky balls on the corner. Oh, do I not? I'm not sure. Oh, I might not. Which one? The uh, frame? <laughs> I think. Uh, no, this bit. This bit here. Which part? Oh, maybe maybe I just hit the mound. I added sticky walls to everything. Yeah, it might it might have been the mound. Yeah, I must have just clipped this. I was gonna say I thought I added it to everything on this one. <laughs> Pinching? <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Can you imagine doing a turtle goal with this, or like air dribbling it? I don't I don't think that's even possible. I'm not sure it's possible. The way oh come on. Oh, that's a shot. Right, surely, right? <laughs> oh, I said surely again, dude. You've done it to me. Yeah, that's my bad. That's my bad. Oh god. I'll start saying dude soon. Yeah, that's actually so true, dude. <laughs> Do you you guys not say dude very often in uh? No. Bro, well, you I say bro, right? Or like you? Bruv, bruv. Yeah. Nah, I was a. Uh, Whoa. I did you? That was when uh when we were all at school and that kind of thing. It was always bruv. Right. Boy. Look at this little like. What? Little dribble. That's that's as close as an air dribble is. <laughs> I don't know if we're gonna be able to do anything different with that, but maybe. It really sometimes just booms, and then other times. Sometimes it just does nothing. Yeah. yeah. I think it's just the reality of what we're de dealing with here. <laughs> like we've got, we can't really complain too much. We've got a double ball flying around the screen, so. Broken the game, yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure Saranix will be able to help with this one. But like, my question is like, why wasn't this around for so long? Like, is it just no one had the initiative to like, get it out there or? Like, you know um, what I, mean? I guess it needs a platform like, like yourself, you know, a pro player oh. picking it up. Yeah, that's true. Like, it needs to be more exposure for people to want to do like do more stuff with it. Look at this. I know Sonix, we're going to start giving it exposure with the monthly uh, workshop. Oh, nice. Uh, the monthly, I think it was a workshop review or something like that. Oh, yeah. Um, like a blog post. And I know French Fries, uh, the one who did the parkour maps. <gasps> oh, no. Um, he was featured on that. And I know that got a lot of people into it. Um, but to be honest, that was before any, you know, good maps were out. Right. Yeah. Like there it was wasn't, no one knew what was possible. As well. Exactly, yeah. Yeah. Um, the rocket launcher guys hosted a couple of competitions. Um, two, I think there's two mapping contests. Yeah. I just read 5 0. 6 0. <laughs> wow, never mind. Um, um, yeah, don't worry about it. We're having fun. Which brought uh, some new mechanics. So, did you see the mech robot one? Oh, God, I played that. It doesn't work anymore, but. Yeah, I see. Does it not? Ah, uh, yeah. It, it, I mean, the bot, everything works, but the bots don't. Like they don't drive at you, or or they just do circles, so they're not scary. Right. Like they just kind of, <laughs> <They're not scary. laughs> like, like they just kind of sit in the middle, so like you can just shoot them over and over again. But yeah, I, I was gonna I was gonna showcase it on on YouTube, but it's just like yeah, not really working the way that it um, used to. No, that was that was a winner from a map contest, though, so that's something that you know a new mechanic. Yeah, and I'm wondering like on. like that's using player inputs, right? Um, yeah, which there's uh, that's that stopped working, I think, or does that still work? 
I we, don't. We I, I think it, it, you can't. You can't detect those anymore. I tried for pinball. Yeah. I just didn't really know what I was doing. Maybe. So there is a different method we can use, which um, I'll show you another time. Okay. Um, we might be able to use in a video, but I'm not sure it replicates over a server. So I'm not sure. I think it would only work for you. Oh, like just to showcase but, it. That's what you're saying. Yeah, but I don't know that for sure. Like I, I wish like this put, stuff. Can I pull on? Yeah, I put it on. I wish there was yeah. like a, you know, a platform where it wasn't like game breaking. So that like yeah. they wouldn't limit you with what you're able to do. Yeah, like I get it for now. Um, there is there's a few things that would help. Um, I don't know if this. Cur I think the curve's working. It's just not doing very much. Try and try and boom it. Oh, like it is. It is moving a little bit. Oh well. <laughs> oh, that's <was> good. <laughs> I don't know if the curve's doing anything. Like not very much anyway. Yeah, it's not, is it? No, so we'll have to play around with that. I'm sure with Alpha Con, so I can change the settings, make it more more curvy. Cool. Yeah, like maybe like add more spin to it. But um, that just wouldn't be available over Workshop. That's the only thing. Right. If I if I'm using Alpha Con, to do it. Oh. Yeah, I mean, like it would be just this, but then you just use Alpha Console to run it. I guess once that yeah. full version is like, is that stuff like ND? Like, are you not supposed to like talk about it or like what you're working on? Uh, they, um, I mean, it's only me working on that that sort of stuff at the moment. Um, me and or myself and butter and cream, right? Uh, from from Rocket Launcher, yeah. Um, are working on porting all of the Rocket Launcher mods into Alpha Concert, right? Uh, which has been announced on the Rocket Launcher Discord, so it's not a secret. Okay. It's taken a bit longer than we thought, but to be honest, like we've both got stuff going on. Right. Okay. Sweet. Yeah. But let's jump into a gigantic ball. Um, yeah. Let's give do that because this isn't doing much. There then we, go. Then we got. We, so that wasn't exciting enough. So we decided to make it giant and uh, a little bit lighter. I can already see it Titan. going to work. Nope. Oh. <laughs> so now that it's giant, you actually have more room to pinch the inside of the ball. Oh. It also hits the mountains. Oh, I see. A yeah, lot yeah. more. I think. You know what? It's actually like the the texture on the ball is kind of oh. cool. I kind of like it. It works, doesn't it? It does kind of work. It's it's really sporadic, but oh my god, yeah, it does hit the mountains a lot more. <laughs> oh. So we were uh, we were talking about like making one of these not have collision <laughs> to troll <laughs> people, but we don't really know if it's gonna work out the way we plan. It would work. Uh, but we're not sure if it's going to be enough to actually fool people because the one without collision is just going to fall through the floor. Yeah, like it'll work out, but because there's it'll, no collision, it just won't. It will still uh, be attached, but uh, yeah, with the rotation, it's just going to end up underground. It's going to end up in the floor the more so. Yeah, like it, sometimes Ooh. it will. Oh, what a pinch. Um, sometimes it'll be off the ground, which might be confusing a little bit, but it's just hard for us to. Because the ball can only have one. <laughs> The ball can only have one material, right? So, okay. So I found the strategy. Well, no, we can do we can do multiple materials, um, but it was it's still just going to get hidden. Oh, one physical material, you mean? Like, the physical like can you have two physical materials where one physical material doesn't like isn't blocked by the car? Uh, no. Oh, no. So that's the issue, right? So like, that's done in the collision. Yeah. Yeah. Like. The archetype, we can only use one archetype for a ball. Um, which would mean that wow. you can only tell the ball to do one thing, and that's to block the car and the walls and stuff. But we can't make it so that it blocks one side blocks the, the car and one side blocks the nothing, I guess, or just the floor. Yeah. Yeah, so that's, that's the we issue. We might find a way, but for <laughs> now. We're talking about, like, maybe having it so that, like... A certain axis point we could we could actually like extend a line out from the center anchor right because you could just keep that z value or um the direction and then stop that from ever going below the ground we'll stop it rotating i mean you could do that that'd be a little weird wouldn't it <laughs> uh, be like, like stop puck. like you could stop z rotation but like leave the x and y like it slides left and right yeah. that's kind of cool that'd be odd 
That would be odd, but I think that's like another. I think that's another but. unique aspect of. Yeah, we, that's actually like what we should do. Just remove uh, any. I mean, that's uh, all this is. We're just trying, trying, trying stuff out, seeing what's fun. Yeah, and like this, this arena here is going to be used for several different tests, like different types of uh, game modes and balls and stuff. So we're just going to like, and we can try a different map as well. We can make another one, um, just to make it keep it fresh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, but that uh, Easter map's going to be a, a lot of fun too. We haven't started oh. it, but we have some ideas of making a fully polished, like, regular Rocket League map. That has Easter just, bunnies and. <laughs> <laughs> just depends what we can get done in the time. Right. Yeah. Like, like what about the dojo? We could use a lot of the, like, who made the dojo map? Dojo map. Yeah, the new one was it DMC? It wasn't DMC, was it? It was sta uh, not standard. DMC Rose. was the hoops maps. Might have been Reniku. Uh. Or Reniku. I don't really know how to say his name. He did. He did Quidditch. Right. Someone else made the the dojo. Maybe we could hit them up and then ask if we can yeah. use the meshes and everything. And then all we have to do is reskin them, right? Uh, yeah. Which is, I guess, the hard part. That's the hard part anyway. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, that's the hard part. I just realized this is only one goal game. I'm talking a lot about what's possible. It's tough. It's tough. Yeah. Because it's so big. But I, I can see this being really oh. fun with a big group of people. Oh, this is... I almost said surely a goal, dude. I gotta... <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, what's oh. happening? No. You hit the inside. I know, I hit that weird part. I see, I can't hit there because so, it's yeah. so, the like, inside. I, so I'm, I'll show you a spot, actually. If you side flip into like when it's laying flat like this, if you side flip into this part like this, it sometimes booms it like that. It sends it forwards because we're inside the mesh, like inside the ball a little bit. It froze. I think it clipped. Yeah, it might have clipped a little bit. Do it here. Oh, oh there you there see. You that's go. that's like sort of what it is. There we go. Did I get it? No. Nope. It's actually it's funny. The, the goal is huge, but <laughs> we can't score. <laughs> One more pinch. Try it. Now. Try it out. Oh, nice oh try. I went backwards. Yeah, I do like these mountains, like the little mounds in the middle. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed that. It was a lot of fun uh, trying out this double ball. We'll definitely experiment more with that that one side having no collision and stuff, and get that out for you guys. But yeah, thanks for playing, Glenn. Thank you. And thanks for uh, creating this wonderful double ball. <laughs> <laughs> that is good fun. It's yeah, good. It's fun. good. Catch you guys later.